desastre de sistema. Com minhas orelhas grandes, as minhas filhas.
foda, viu? Estilo. Pistola dele. De onde ele tira essa força, essa pistola ninguém sabe. Eu acredito que nosso amiguinho deve estar procurando um vingança, né? Pelo que mostrou ali na, na história. To get to the bottom of Daisy's death, I went searching for the famed prophet, Gladius. I found her inside the tavern, with her ware spread out on the round tabletop. She was old, older than I had imagined. Her eyes met mine, but before I could speak, she asked if I was the son of Dante. It seemed she had been waiting for me all this while. But I didn't seek her for all that, and patience was never a virtue of mine. I demanded her to look into the crystal ball of hers, to find me the man behind that murderous night. Instead, she mentioned that my destiny was hung over her neck, and proceeded to remove her neck piece. It was akin to a compass, and it glittered and blinked profusely in front of my eyes. The old lady explained that the compass and my destiny were woven together. She was about to elaborate, but she never got the chance. Someone had taken her life. Someone familiar. A face that I had seen on that fateful night. A face I couldn't forget. I was glad he found me before I found him. It was obvious he didn't want Gladius talking to me. Something tells me I was on the right path.
Ai, super aqui no Vasco. Revenge was ever so slightly quenched by the sight of Redo lying on the ground, his face covered in blood. In a plea for me to spare his life, he began offering me a name. Craven. I've heard that name before. Craven was an enigmatic and powerful warlord feared by all. It was then I realized that Redo was simply a pawn. Craven was the mastermind behind all of it. Through the corner of my eye, I saw Redo standing up ready to ambush me. But that wasn't gonna happen, as Rogel appeared in the nick of time. With a cannon taller than himself, he took Redo out. For saving my life, he asked that I seek out Craven with him. Rondell was a complete stranger up till that night. <laughs> 